Pagaliau įvyko pasaulinė apimondija. Metus atkelta dėl covido, vėliau pakibusi ant plauko dėl karo, nes turėjo vykti Rusijoje, pagaliau įvyko Stambule. Patreon ir kontribi platformose netrukus pradės suskelbti net septynis į lietuvių kalbą išverstus, mano manimų įdomiausius, mokslinius pranešimus iš apimondijos mokslinės dalies. Paroda yra viena svarbiausių apimondijos dalių, todėl pristatau jums savo top 3 įdomiausius atradimus 2022 m. apimondijos parodoje. Trečia vieta – įdomus daugiau aukščio avelio viršutinės dalies papildymas. So, you replace the traditional beehive cover and you put this one, okay? This is, but maybe the, maybe the dantrum will not catch my Look, so here, you can open like that. You can put the syrup here. And you can also, you can inspect your beehive from here. But you can also open this. So you can put food like that. Look here. You can put the syrup. You can also inspect your beehive without have to, you don't have to remove this one. So you just open the upper cover and here you are. Syrup, inspect of beehive and you can also put food without have to smoke or something. Nothing. Yeah. You don't need to smoke. For other beehives, we have another one. This is just a 3D print. It's not yet in production. But look, it can uh, fit any beehive. Even yeah. Dandan, whatever. But in this case, you have to keep the traditional beehive cover. Mm -hmm. So you put this under your cover. So you put, you have to keep your traditional beehive uh -huh. cover. But it has the same specs. Again, you can inspect and you can put the syrup here. Yeah. So it's the same, but for all other types of uh, beehives. This is only for Langthorff. And in this case, you replace the traditional beehive mm -hmm. cover. But here, you keep the... But again, you don't have to remove here something like that. This is below your original... Uh, Yeah. So again, you have to put your cover. Yeah. It's going to your uh, your cover. It's going to be to fit. Yeah. Fit. Yeah. Yeah. This yeah. Is how you look it's the same specs, specs, but you keep your traditional behind. Yeah. Cover. Very interesting. Okay. Thank you. And this one is going to be, I think, pretty enough bit tip. So May be behind the uh, here. Antra vieta – saliginai nebrangus ir efektyvus aparatas skirtas gydimui oksalo rūkštimi. So please tell me uh, what this uh, machine is about. Uh, this machine for oxalic acid application uh, for varroa treatment. Uh, it turns the uh, liquid uh, to the fog, uh, so you can uh, add the, uh, this area uh, oxalic acid and water mixture. Uh, so this machine turns the fog. You can uh, apply uh, under the cover with uh, this part. Uh, this is chargeable system. You can easily carry in the apiary. So it's uh, it's not heavy. No, no. Oh, very not heavy. <laughs> uh, with full charge, uh, it's enough for uh, 200 colonies. Uh, there are time settings, half minute, um, one minute and one and a half minute. Uh, you can uh, set the time your uh, heel size. Uh, for example, time frame uh, is enough for half minute. Uh, but two floor, uh, one and a half minute is uh, enough for. Um, And how does it work? Uh, it's not a heater, yes? Uh, no, there is no heating system in it. It's just electronic system and ultrasonic system uh, because uh, fog is uh, different and uh, audible system uh, in there. Uh, you hear the voice, uh, the finish, uh, the fog, uh, so you can uh, switch the uh, high. Uh, and uh, also uh, a lot of oxalic acid uh, because formic acid, uh, amitraz, etc., etc., uh, other chemicals uh, harm the electronic system. Yeah. So just oxalic acid and um, some uh, aromatic uh, natural waters you can uh, apply uh, to the hive. Mm -hmm. And what is the percentage of uh, oxalic uh, and water? I mean, uh, you pour some water and you add some oxalic acid. Yes, and, uh, yes. Uh, five gram oxalic acid uh, melted in 200 milliliter water uh, is enough, uh, and you can put. 
the water like this and then so easy. and push the blue button and start the focus again. So it's uh, it's uh, am I right uh, that when I am saying that it's not a va vapor, it's like a aerosolic? Uh, uh, not vapor. Vapor yeah. and fog uh, is different between yeah. us. Uh, we separated the waters, um, some uh, elements, uh, so uh, it made fog. Uh, fog um, separate, uh, apply under the cover. Fog uh, separate all frames and uh, all the hive. Yeah. Uh, so uh, it's very effective way. Okay. Uh, and you said uh, the. <coughs> Sorry, uh, the battery is for 200 families, yeah. and you can charge it by simple electric uh, charger. Yeah, yeah, you and can uh, replace it and replace it. We give the uh, chargeable cable, and you can uh, take home and charge it. Uh, eight hour charge is enough. Uh, after uh, charge, you can uh, take it and place again. That's it. Okay, and uh, you said eight hours, yeah, uh, yeah. to recharge it. And the price? Uh, Two hundred seventy dollars. Two hundred seventy. And you, where are you from? Uh, we are from Turkey, uh, and we are producers. Uh, we some innovative beekeeping machines uh, and fogging machines. One of these. <laughs> okay, and uh, your name? Where can we find you? Uh, Arsum Apima. Uh, Arsum Apima. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much. Mano pirma vieta. Apiterapinis avilys skirtas vidaus patalpoms. Please tell me, please tell me more uh, about this. Uh, yes, this is the uh, first indoor uh, hive for your house or office. You can put it wherever you want and you can collect all the bee product from this hive. But uh, how the bees are going in and out? They have interaction with the nature through the holes. You need to drill a hole on oh. your wall so they can interact with the nature, you know? Yeah, so, so you can put this inside your house? Yes, this is only for your house. You, know? you cannot put it outside because it's transparent and the yeah. sun will, will kill it, you know? Okay. And uh, this, this is the uh, entrance and you can collect pollen. You see, you have pollen. You can have fresh pollen every day in your house to put it in smoothie or wherever you want. This is uh, if you want to have bee venom therapy, you know, to, yeah. put, to put bees in this syringe and then take... So the, you open the door, the bees are going in. Yes, open the, the door and force the bees to go outside. Yeah. Then open this hatch. Bridge, <laughs> yes, and then put it in the stretch. Put this, and then if you want to stretch yeah. wherever you want, just <laughs> for the queen. So yeah, this yeah. is this is the small pharmacy for your room. You know, yeah. you have small pharmacy in your house. So you have bee pollen, you have bee stings, bee stings. You have honey. Yeah. You know, that's that's the product uh, that people know about the bees. But these other products are much better. You can take uh, up inhalation. You know, to put your mask on you and. Uh, 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 turn on the fan and suck the air from the hive. You turn know? on the fan so it has electricity? No, you, you put the battery inside. Oh! You yeah. put batteries, universal batteries, everywhere in the world. And then you suck the air from the hive so you can inhale to yeah. cure some chest disease yes. like uh, asthma, bronchitis, etc. Uh, but because it's, it's in your house, you know, there is ventilation everywhere and you breathe that air every day you know but if yeah. you want extra air you can you can use it you know yeah and we have a propolis strap you know so yeah. you can you can take even propolis from your house so it all be product in one our product bmon.com and you can use everything in your house or even in your office you know we have some IT companies in Serbia they are testing this product because uh, they are uh, always on computers you know and then uh, don't have good concentration so they can eat healthy and fresh products from bees and uh, become more productive in the, in the work you know okay so a few more questions uh, okay. first uh, what is the price the price depends on the attachments yeah. the basic price for uh, uh, 
example, observation hive, if you want to put it in kindergarten, yeah. school, university, wherever you want, because everything is transparent, you can see everything, every process of the bees. The, the start price is uh, 700 euros, mm -hmm. and if you want with all attachment, the price is 1,100 euros. Okay, and uh, who, who and how changes the honeycomb, and, uh, and how often you have to change it? We have one hive, it's seven years old, we didn't change nothing, queen is still there, because the queen doesn't lay too much eggs, and yeah. she can last longer, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But this particular honeycomb is without the eggs, yeah? It's, it's just no, it, there is eggs, but these bees are preparing for winter, yeah. oh, and there yeah, is a small amount of, the, of, of eggs and brood on this side, you see? Oh, yeah, really? So, these, these bees are preparing for winter, so they, they lower the, the brood. You know? and, and the family of this size can last, yeah? So yes, because uh, that, that's the point. In a room or in office, the temperature is constant. In the winter, they don't need to heat. Yeah. In the summer, they don't need to cool the hive, you know? Yeah. So they don't use too much energy for that part. Yeah, mm -hmm. so let's say it lasts for five years. Uh, okay. And then after that, you need to change the honey wax uh, or, 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 or not? Uh, Mainly you don't need to change because I told you they don't uh, produce so much brood and they don't, uh, you know, they don't uh, make impact on, on the wax. Uh, oh, okay. It's mainly honey, pollen and the brood is the smallest part. Have you ever... Uh, okay. Have ever occurred the situation where uh, uh, honey queen, uh, bee queen needs yes. to be changed? Or yes, or yes. Uh, if if the colony gets smaller, yeah. you know, and you need to replace the queen, you just put a new colony yeah. inside the box, like when you starting a new colony, attach it, oh. and the bigger colony will populate it. You know, and that's in that way you can change the queen. The other way, if if uh, the 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 hive is full, then you can uh, and they they lose the queen, you know. But the hive is full. You just need to replace the queen because the the old one is dead. You just attach the attachment for the queen cage and put in yeah. one, and that's it. Okay. So, but when the wax and the nest becomes very old, okay. uh, do we send it to you to put a new yes, wax, or we can uh, do it ourselves? Uh, I told you we didn't. We we researched this product uh, for seven years now, and uh, we didn't have such situation, you know. But yeah. the, uh, uh, one hive we used to scrape the old wax mm -hmm. and put the bees, and they build new one without oh, the problem. So you know? it's plastic. Uh, it's plastic foundation. Yes, plastic foundation. Yes. Oh, okay. because be yeah. you you can see the, the empty one. It's because oh, of really? uh, it's it's because of uh, customs and export rules of some country. You know. You can export wax in some country, but some country doesn't allow wax import, you know, so this this is the better way to export the hive. You know? Very nice. Yes. If you want, you can wax it, but it's not necessary. Bees will do it without wax. Okay, I believe you will go big. <laughs> Thank yes, you. yes. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you. Mano pasirinkimai. Prenumeruokite, būkite kartu. Iki.